General Hans Krebs, born on March 4, 1898, in Helmstedt, Germany, was a career military officer who rose to prominence during the tumultuous years of the Second World War. He joined the German army where Hermack during the interwar period, and by the time World War II erupted, he had already established himself as a competent and capable officer. One of the pivotal moments in General Krebs' military career came in 1944 when he was appointed as the Chief of the German Army General Staff. This position placed him at the heart of strategic planning and decision-making within the German military apparatus by then holding the rank of General Oberst Colonel General, found himself thrust into a challenging period for the Nazi regime. As Chief of the General Staff, Krebs faced the daunting task of managing the German military's operations in the face of overwhelming Allied advances on both the Eastern and Western fronts. His tenure coincided with a series of devastating defeats for the German forces including the Battle of Normandy and the Soviet offensives on the Eastern Front. One of the most notable events associated with General Hans Krebs occurred during the final days of the war. In late April 1945, as the Allies closed in on Berlin, General Krebs played a crucial role in the German defence strategy. He was tasked with negotiating the terms of surrender with the Soviet Union. On April 28, 1945, General Krebs, accompanied by General Wilhelm Bergdorf, met with Soviet General Vasily Chuikov in the ruins of Berlin. However, the negotiations proved futile and the unconditional surrender of German forces took place shortly afterward on May 7, 1945. After the war, General Hans Krebs' life took a tragic turn. In the aftermath of Germany's defeat, he was taken into Soviet captivity. His fate remains uncertain as there are conflicting accounts of whether he died in Soviet custody or took his own life. The circumstances surrounding General Krebs' death continue to be a subject of historical debate. Despite the controversies surrounding the end of his life, General Hans Krebs played a significant role in the military hierarchy of Nazi Germany during a critical period. His experiences and decisions reflect the complexities and challenges faced by military leaders in the waning days of World War II. Thanks for watching.